away from the first defender, but taken on the advantage line. Waters now. Be careful, one. Now Zachary gets the ball away in the tackle. USA, Kelter, big, strong and powerful. Alan Kelter, we've talked about how good she is. Breaking down the Canadian midfield defence. And then they move the ball swiftly throughout the hands here. And Kelter, she's got space out wide. She's got players, but she doesn't need them. She fends off Tessia and Ferries to go through. Too big, too strong. Great try, Alan Kelter. And a little tip on now, kill done. Sorry. Now Dow, Abby Dow around the first defender, around the second. And now she comfortably run, Abby Dow. We have seen some skill and some brilliance today. But what about Abby Dow inside out on the last two defenders? And she made a very, very difficult try. Look, very, very easy. Abby Dell, that's a big moment for her. She never thought she would be running out at this World Cup after suffering a major injury this year. But she shows why she is an exceptional player with her brilliance of footwork out on that wing. From the London Wasps. Demand or oh, nicely done under pressure as Tui goes through the Australian defence, takes on the line, and Ruby Tui's solo effort is pumped. Look at this under pressure bomb on the inside by the skipper, Ruby Tui just slices him. You know what? Still got some work to do. I'm going to go through one touch. Exclamation mark on a fantastic performance from the right hand winger. The confidence to take it upon herself. Ruby Tui. She's personality plus, but she's got the substance to back up everything she does. Ruby Tui sets Eden Park alight. Good skills from Webb. Royce down as far as Dow on halfway. Is Abby Dow going to wind up there? Things haven't gone her way. Yes, she is. Shepping it towards the side. Gets a brilliant ball back in field for Hurd. Hurd's got Galligan, and Rosie Galligan's going to get a hat trick. This skill from Tatiana Hurd. Abby Dow goes on the outside of a hooker. That's a mass match all day. Look at the hurt. The way she's able to position herself, then straightens the ball up, takes out three defenders, and then passes that ball out to his second rower. How good. There's a number of England flags being waved in the crowd. A couple of those will be her mum and dad who have made the trip to watch her play here in Aotearoa, New Zealand. Absolutely worth every penny <coughs> but the work of abby dow too remember that's the woman who suffered a serious broken leg oh, slow coming out so i go Stop to the boot slow. here cross field up in the line was emma kugi now she scampers back leans on that left foot it's charged down and the chase is on and canada <laughs> touchdown early through paige farris to scoot backwards the inexperienced fullback didn't come up and take it and lovely chase boom straight over five points early advantage great charge down two it's a bit to do down low as well for Faris. she was at home back in 2017 watching her nation do their thing in that world cup has it tucked under that left arm? They're five metres out at the moment. Australia Talakai looks right and left, decides what the options are, and it's Butty Basanga who will take it upon herself. Out they come. Mackenzie across for Fredericks, ghosting across. Pliate in the line. Here's Teresa again. Bia Teresa gets her second. She is a powerhouse, this young winger, and she has given Australia one heck of a start to this match. Defense. And Australia are getting outside, see they're all jamming in, so what that does, once you get outside the 13, you're having to save and then push across. And when you get a lady like this, who can finish? And Tanita, 
She still had a lot of work to do, and she does it well. Here's the outside break. The defense is having to push across, straighten, power, and finish. You now use the opportunity to take meters off the defense. Now they're on the five, now they're on the four. Now the three power. Just short. Now she gets down, another try. Well, they lose nothing with their bench. They've emptied their bench and the reserves have come on and taken the game to another level. And it's the low numbers again. Connie Powell, Hannah Bottomman, Maud Muir really muscling up as they continue to stretch the scoreboard out for England. They're on the four now. Powell loses her ground, Packer. And a lovely kick out on the left edge with a clinical finish for McDonald. Oh, it's full credit to the England boards. They set that ball up perfectly. They drive 19 metres. Unlucky not to claim that try for them, but it's the skills of Emily Scarrett out wide with the kick pass. Claudia McDonald. Yes, back it goes for McKenzie to clear under pressure. Does well to easy, get it away. Easy, Not easy. out though, it's there for Tui as the Eden Park crowd comes to life. Holmes, Demant, a little bit of footwork from Rua Hay. Demant holds the ball, pops it for Tui. Tui for Holmes and now Woodman. Woodman going to take them on in the corner. Woodman crosses over. Ruby Tui, been huge the first, I realise they got numbers. The man straightens up the play, pops the ball up, Tui again involved. Renee Holmes realises where the speed is, Portia Woodman, too strong, too good. This will be a pretty angle, look at that skill there to pop up, the vision from the skipper, the vision from Ruby Tui, and then the finish from Portia Woodman, you won't get a better view than what's coming up right here. To the front. Come on. Go Canada, and it is to Tossi at the tail. Now they transfer again. It goes down another fresh penalty advantage awarded. They won't need it. Emily to Tossi drives through and puts her side back in front. And make the attacker herself. Let's have a look. Straight up at two. Beautiful body position there in the mall. See they've got the ball a couple of layers back. So Japan defence can't reach through. Then Totossi reacts, heads up play, goes herself, gets over the line with fantastic power. There it is, the photoshop.